Xin chào tất cả quý vị, cảm ơn quý vị đã đăng ký kênh cho Khánh Bình Kênh này kênh giao lưu, kênh này là kênh những tình thương mến thương của gia đình Cũng như là à, sinh nhật, à, tiệc cưới hay là đi du ngoạn, nấu ăn, chuyện gì gia đình nha Khánh Bình từ Việt Nam bay qua bên Úc để sang bên Úc để dự đám cưới của một người em Dạ, à, cả nhà thấy không, đám cưới rất long trọng cả nhà Bên Úc không khí rất là mát mẻ này, cô dâu chú rể rất là đẹp xinh đẹp luôn một cô dâu việt nam và lấy người chồng đó là người tây là người mỹ như thế này là rất là xuống đôi dù lứa luôn cái nhà xe hát cái này đi rất là hay tại vì lần đầu tiên chúng mình bay qua từ việt nam mà dự cái đám cưới rất là long trọng như gì người việt nam cũng rất là nhiều à, cái mình bay qua đây hát cũng rất là nhiều à, thành ra là à, rất mọi người rất là thân yêu yêu thương cái mình lắm cái gì quý vị xem hết clip này nghe vui lắm dễ thương lắm quý vị ơi nhất là chú chó kinh của cô dâu chú rể đó quý vị rất là tuyệt vời rất là khôn luôn quý vị chúc quý vị vui vẻ buổi chiều Well, good afternoon, friends and family, and welcome to this truly wonderful occasion to witness the union of Chris and Jesse. A big warm welcome to everyone here, and a huge thank you on behalf of the couple for coming to be a part of their wonderful day. Each of you play an important role in their lives, and they're just thrilled to be able to share this with you. The couple would especially like to acknowledge those of you who've traveled from far and wide to be here. Your presence is truly appreciated. We also take this moment to remember those who are no longer with us, but are in our thoughts today and forever. In particular, Jessie's late father, who she holds dearly in her heart, who is definitely here in spirit and is watching down on us today. My name is Beth Parker, and I am duly authorized by law to solemnize marriages according to law. And so, before you, Christopher Daniel Tuffy, and you, Ut T. Nguyen, are joined in marriage, in my presence, and in the presence of your witnesses, and to remind you of the solemn and binding nature of the relationship you're about to enter. Marriage, according to law, is a union of two people to the exclusion of all others voluntarily entered into for life. So we are here today to witness the union of these two people and to join in the celebration of the beginning of a new chapter in their lives together. Chris and Jesse first met while studying architecture at Curtin University. In 2007, they were both on a study trip to Mount Barker, where Jesse first noticed Chris. She couldn't help but notice Chris's amazing poker skills, but it was his chivalrous charms that she was impressed by when, during a game of spoon slap poker, he sacrificed himself for the girls so they didn't lose and cop a spoon across the knuckles. Chris was obviously too busy being such a gallant gentleman at that poker game because he didn't notice Jessie till later on. And by notice, we mean he saw her waltzing through the campus corridors during study break and thought she had a nice set of legs. <laughs> so after years of close friendship, their relationship turned into a love story. On their first date, Jessie took Chris to dinner at Matsuri and tried to woo him with Japanese cuisine. Chris tried to impress Jesse with his chopstick holding skills. And while he's standing here today, so he must have scored a 10. Since that date, they have shared the best of life by each other's side. They both love traveling and experiencing different cultures, eating street food and meeting new friends. They have purchased, purchased a house and continue to work on making it into the perfect home for them and their chubby little corgi Marley here in the front row. 
Together, they have built a loving and respectful relationship built on sticky ribs, Korean barbecue, and trips to Bunnings. Jessie loves Chris for his honest and genuine nature. She loves the way he is respectful, patient, and caring with those around him, and especially his family. She appreciates his unwavering support and unconditional loyalty. She loves to watch his playful and nurturing side come out with his nephews and niece. All this with a touch of country boy charm. Chris loves Jessie for the smart, witty, and talented woman she is. He loves how extremely capable she is in all aspects of life and knows that he can rely on her no matter what. He adores her endless compassion and thoughtfulness and how she takes care of all of those around her. He thinks she's beautiful inside and out and with a smile second to none. In the future, they wish to continue traveling the world, exploring new and exciting destinations, building on the memories they share together, and maybe in the future, bringing some kids of their own along for the ride. And so today, we bring this all together in marriage. And marriage to this couple means sharing the simple moments with the person we love, having someone to laugh and cry with all while watching Netflix. And so now we have Chris's sister Diane to perform a reading to mark this occasion. She would like to join us. you're holding is the one who holds your heart, and the one whose arms you gaze into is your hopes and dreams sister. When the one you think of first and last is the one who holds you tight, and the things you plan together make the whole world seem just right. When the one who you believe in puts their faith and trust in you, you found the one and only love you share your whole life. And now Chris and Jesse have chosen to recite their vows to each other with their friends and family to witness. Chris, if you're ready, you can begin. Jesse, I promise to be your handyman, best friend, protector, and lover. To be the man who brings you the blanket when you are cold, to hold your handbag in times of need. <laughs> I will treat every day as an opportunity for me to express my love for you surprise you, form your heart, make it almost impossible for you not to fall deeper in love with me. I promise to love every part of you, your cute dimples, heartwarming smile, infectious personality and beautiful mind. To always be there to support you through the difficult times. When you are sad, I will be there to make you smile, to offer unconditional encouragement as you chase your dreams and a helping hand if you wish each and every morning I wake up beside you, I pinch myself. You make me feel like I'm dreaming. You make me feel like the luckiest man alive. Jesse, I vow to hold your hand in mine as we travel through our journey together. To never let your hand slip from mine. To always remain loyal and truthful and never keep secrets from you. Now and forever. You are and always will be the one and only Anne Kate. Call upon the people here present. Witness that I, Christopher Tucky. Thank you, Jesse Newell. You are both the red and white. I can top that. <laughs> My darling Chris, from the day we first met, I knew there was something above average about you. From your competitive nature to your boyish charms to the way you use the word viscosity in every sentence because you, make it, you think it makes you sound smarter. I've fallen in love with your imperfections because to me, they make you perfect. I love how we're both OCD about very different things, which often leads to immature arguments and ends in preschool fights. If I had to do it all over again though, I wouldn't change a single thing. If I because you, my love, is the nitrous oxide to my NOS. <laughs> the twin turbo to my engine. Together, we can run a quarter mile faster than Dom and Letty could even say ride or die. Please forgive me for my stubborn and hard-headed ways, for all my shortcomings and irrational days. 
and in turn, I promise I will bring you a cold beer whenever the temperature exceeds 30 degrees outside. We've been through very difficult times in the past, but never once have you ever given up on us. Thank you for your unconditional love and support. Thank you for always being there, even when I acted like I didn't need you. Truth to the matter is, I always did, and I always will need you. From this day forward, I vow to be the stronger woman that you deserve, to help you carry the weight of life when your shoulders get too heavy. Whenever you feel like you've been defeated, I promise to give you the strength and the courage to charge forward. I promise, to take, I promise not to take you for granted, to show you the kindness and patience in times of struggle and celebrate with you in moments of success. I cannot wait to start the next chapter of our lives together and create new memories as husband and wife. Dad, if you're up there watching, please love, accept and protect this man like how you've loved, cherished and protected me when you were with us. I call upon the people here present to Melissa I, Jesse Nguyen, to you, Christopher Tucky, to be my lawful wedded husband. Jesse and Chris have chosen to present each other with wedding bands. Rings are a symbolic exchange to show the never-ending love between a couple, and they will wear them as a sign of their commitment for everyone to see. Now, I believe we have a special delivery for the rings. Marley, bring them on up. <laughs> Jesse to be your lawful wife? Do you promise to be supportive of each other as individuals, never trying to change the other, to support and encourage and give all that you've got for the rest of your lives? I do. Just a few more questions. Do you promise to destroy spiders and everything else that Jesse deems creepy or gross? <laughs> I do. Do you promise to let Jesse rein you in at Bunnings because you probably already have enough tools in the shop for now? <laughs> I do. <laughs> do you promise to try not to steal the covers at night or fart in bed while Jesse is sleeping? <laughs> I do. And do you vow to embrace Jesse's love of puppies and promise to let her have as many as her heart desires and never ever complain about your missing socks? <laughs> Everyone witnessed that. <laughs> and if we could now please have Chris. ring as a token of my promise wear it and think of me and know that I love you Jesse do you take Chris to be your lawful husband do you promise to be supportive of each other as individuals never trying to change the other to support and, and encourage and give all that you've got for the rest of your lives I do do you promise to listen to Chris and at least pretend to show interest in horsepower, engines, custom mod modifications, even if you have no idea what he's talking about? I do. <laughs> do you promise to take walks with Marley every Saturday morning, provided Chris takes care of the dog poo and buys you coffee? I do. <laughs> and do you promise to laugh at Chris's jokes and think everything he makes with his bare hands is full of awesomeness? I do. 
For this couple will share their life in each other's arms. May you be united together and feel nothing but complete. Now that they have vowed to love, support, and cherish each other from this day forward, I would now like to invite everyone to join me in wishing you both a life of love and happiness, as I now pronounce you to be husband and wife, and you may kiss your beautiful bride.